Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to our channel. Welcome to another one of our videos. Today we're going to talk about Virgin Galactic. SPCE. We'll cover the analyst news. We've got a couple articles that just came out. We have special short interest news. Just was updated in the last, last 24 hours. And then we'll look at our positions and review the charts. Now in our positions here, we've been making money over the past month. And I'm going to show you that. I'm going to give you a quick sneak preview of our end of month report. And if you're new to our channel, go ahead, click the money icon below to review our past videos. Please smash the like button and subscribe. So let's get busy. All right, here's our current position. We still have one option against our position. And we'll see what happens on the 20th of August. If everything goes well, we'll collect that $586 total profit off the position. Let's snap into the monthly report real quick. We went over our 3% already. Uh, we received over $4,000 worth of profits for July. And look at this. You see the number there? Because we picked up an extra $1,730 this week already profits. These positions are closed already. And for the whole month of July, in premiums and profits, we picked up $8,598 to support our position. I'm telling you, covered calls and selling put options, it pays when the market goes down on your stocks. Remember, that's what we're here for. We're here to put money in your pocket. Pick up that cash off the ground. Virgin Galactic, it popped up. Before we get to the articles here, we'll cover this real quick. The volume was only 12.4 million shares and normally is 41 million. Apparently, people are keeping them. And the shorts, apparently, is not too much interest in trying to sell this stuff short right now. So we popped up 3.11% during hours and after hours of 0.38 percent so far let's look down here at the analysts see if there's any changes i don't see no changes here uh, we're currently between the average and the low and the high is still 51 dollars a share let's go straight on to our short interest report this just came out last 24 hours there is a change between 6 30 june 30th and july 15th of about 12.6 percent so there was an increase in short positions and this was based off the price of the report of $31.74 uh, just a little bit higher just a couple of pennies higher than we are now so what does that mean that means we got 19.5 percent of the shares shorted that means at any given time that the reddit folks want to get into this and want to pump up this volume they can turn around and do a short squeeze on this stock at any given time. That's why it's critical to read these reports. Okay, so when you do your cover calls, make sure your cover calls are above what you, what you got in at them. You know what I'm saying? I mean, at any given time, these guys can pop this stock. And we know what levels it can go to when they pop it. All right, the first article here, it says Bear of the Day, Virgin Galactic. Well, Bear of the Day went up 3.11%. What a deal. I don't mind owning this bear. That's, this is uh, Wednesday. So apparently they were talking about the previous day. Uh, you guys can read this report. It'll go through the, the product offering where they're going to be selling uh, some shares on the market. Here's a takeaway. There is no way for me to value SPC without guessing. We all know that space travel is the future. So we're just getting a piece of the action. That's all. This article will be down below so you can review it. Here's the other article. Uh, that came out yesterday at 4.36 p.m. And they're talking about last year's prediction arrival of the U.S. recession. A little bit of that. But then they come out here. Is Virgin Galactic going to take off soon? Money managers were becoming less confident. They're in 17 hedge fund portfolios at the end of the first quarter, 2021. Uh, the all-time high was a total of 32. There were 23 hedge funds in our database position at the end of the fourth quarter. I'm going to place this down below as well. Apparently, this was this is another bear that's writing these stories. I just want to show you guys all in the news when they come out. Let's get on to their chart. Now, this is what I like. I think we're forming a base right now. These are one. This is one-day intervals. We're above the 
the 200 day and we're above the the 50 day and if this is going to be the new bottom then hopefully in the next couple of weeks we'll find out where the resistant levels are going to be because right now the only resistance i see is at 33 37 that's right here when it failed that was on 721 and we're talking a week ago or so so we can't really use that as resistance but we could use back here we could say the next resistance would be somewhere around 35 35 dollars so as long as we if we could break through 33 37 i think we can go higher up to 35 or so until we get some more flights out there or until we get some more contracts or some positive news unless the reddit people want to take it again you know what they did up here look at this any given week they can do this to the stock because there's hardly any volume the volume has died over the past i would say the past nine days i appreciate everybody watching our video today if you have any questions or comments please place them down below please tell us what your positions are if you're doing cover calls against it if you're selling puts if you're buying puts or you're buying calls against a stock go ahead click the like button and subscribe to our channel until next time this is sunny i'm out